Hello, my name is Kanya Bobinson. I'm a set designer and a background artist on Tales of Lethrian. In this video, I'll walk you through how I created the set design for the city of Dern. So at this stage, I'm just uh, sketching out the city. The city is built in a big volcano, which uh, I actually drew before starting the uh, city itself. And you can see it's sort of transparent beneath the sketch of the city here. Uh, the sketch is uh, going to, I'm just going to build the uh, basic shapes and uh, it's just going to help me figure out where I want the different um, buildings in the design, uh, as well as uh, help me figure out the perspective. So at this stage I'm just keeping it really simple and I'm um, just having fun with it. So the purpose of the set design is to serve as a, a sort of reference for our, uh, when we design our backgrounds. And um, for that purpose I also took out some of the buildings uh, that I just quickly sketched and I made some uh, more detailed sketches of them so that we could reference them later if, for instance, we needed to make a, um, a downtown view or any background basically that had a building up close. Um, these buildings are not meant to be like final designs, but they give the artist a, a general idea of the style. Once I'm happy with my sketch, I start the line art phase. And this is a really fun part, because this is where I get to really go in and, um, and define all the buildings that I've until now uh, only loosely sketched out. Uh, this is also where I get to add all these uh, little details that makes the city seem inhabited. The city of Dern is inspired in part by the Grand Canyon, uh, Santorini in Greece, and um, a bit by Rome as well. Uh, like Santorini, it's, uh, it has sort of a squarish architectural design and uh, it's built in levels which are connected by many stairs. Dern also has a lot of different plants and trees uh, that grow in the city and these were added to uh, add some variation and to give it that Mediterranean feel also found in the places that inspired the city. Uh, so I just went and added these elements as I went along. I added the uh, the palm trees and the, the vines that creep along the rooftops and uh, they in turn added a lot of uh, character to the place. It was really interesting making the uh, different parts of the city. Uh, it's not like a huge city but it does have some points of interest uh, like uh, the market street and the park uh, and the spa with the hot springs that you can see me drawing here uh, and the discotheque which is basically a giant windmill. For me, the best thing about designing something like this is that uh, you're, you're basically making a small world and in order for your world to be believable, you have to sort of put yourself in there and think about uh, where you would go and what you'd do and uh, what you might see while being there. And hopefully, if you do your job properly, then when other people look at it, they will think the same and think uh, what it would be like to actually be in the world you've created. And there you go, there's the final design. So, thank you very much for watching the video. Uh, if you liked it, then please subscribe and stay tuned for more.